जनरेटर रिमोट स्टार्ट और ऑटोमेटिक स्टार्ट एज आई एक्सप्लेन यू इन द लास्ट वीडियो ऑफ पावर लर्निंग चैनल दैट वॉट एवर इज द कंट्रोलर टाइप इवन इट इज स्मार्ट जेन डीप सी कॉमैप कैटरपिलर कंट्रोलर एफ जी विल्सन कंट्रोलर एम टी यू कंट्रोलर द वर्किंग ऑपरेशन फॉर द रिमोट स्टार्ट इज द सेम ओके देर इज नो डिफरेंस बिटवीन हाउ वी विल कनेक्ट because in all all of these controller they are working on same principle okay so in today's video i will explain you how what is the type of ats and how we will connect the wiring of our remote start and how the generator start automatically and stop automatically so my dear friends my name is muzammil ismail and you are watching power learning channel so if you still didn't subscribe my channel kindly subscribe the channel so you will get always the notification of new videos so my dear friends as you see you are using different kind of ats panel and generator controllers but the working principle of remote start or mains failure are same so i will explain you first two things a one when, when whenever you have a controller you have to see that this is this generator controller is only remote start controller or with the mains failure feature okay because in amf controller in amf controllers like deep c 7320 डीप सी सिक्स वन टू ज़ीरो ओके डीप सी फोर फाइव टू ज़ीरो दीज ऑल काइंड ऑफ एम एफ कंट्रोलर्स ओके बट इफ़ यू आर यूजिंग डीप सी सिक्स वन वन ज़ीरो डीप सी फोर फाइव वन ज़ीरो डीप सी सेवन थ्री वन ज़ीरो दीज आर ओनली ऑटो स्टार्ट कंट्रोलर्स ओके सो वॉट इज़ द डिफरेंस बिटवीन ऑटो स्टार्ट एंड मेन्स फेलियर कंट्रोलर the mains failure controller you will always find digital inputs and also the mains voltage sensing terminals the mains voltage terminal sensors uh, wiring you will connect on the back side of the controller where it is writing mains okay so once you will connect the mains you have option to select that how you want to operate your ats panel okay how you want to start and stop the generator okay because our generator when we are using with amf controller we are sensing main supply for remote start and off remote start and remote stop okay so how it will be work once the mains power is fail the generator controller sense the mains power is fail and it will give start signal through internal plc to the generator controller to start the genset this is number one thing but if you don't have mains failure controller and you have only auto start controller so how you will connect your ats controller with the generator so this is also very easy just you have to consider because sometime you are comment commenting me that where we need to connect the wire this is depend on your supplier wiring so you always find two connectors inside the your control panel in ats and also in generator where it is writing remote start in case if you don't find these terminal okay so what you have to do you have to do what like you have to program a digital input in your controller so digital input normally you will find numbers different numbers in your controller okay so in digital inputs you can choose any free terminal which is free uh, there is no wire connected you will connect a wire there and one wire you will take from battery negative okay and this wire you will take it to your ats controller and once the ats panel is having failure signal this contact become close and once this signal is close it will give signal to generator to start so in this way auto start function will be work and once the power will return this signal will get open and when the signal is open it will give command generator to stop again in the standby mode so i try to explain very simple that how the remote start function is working 
in the generator with AMF controller and with the remote start. So if you have still further question, okay, so you can ask me, I will make another video on it to share with you guys because once the remote start signal is coming through the digital input okay it is only getting the signal only normally closed signal getting from your ats panel with negative signal okay so my dear friends thank you very much for watching have a nice day assalamu alaikum